Hi everybody, this is Ithi Readings and hi Pisces. Let's see what messages are going to show up for you. In case this reading resonates, there will be a link in the description box to the extended. I will also link your soulmate reading in the description box below. Okay, so let's have a look. What do we have for Pisces for the month of December? New beginnings. Prosperity begins. Oh, we also have fulfillment of wishes. Oh, do I like it a lot? <clears throat> I feel like Pisces, you're letting go of an old friend or an old lover, probably. Okay. And you're also getting over mental conflict. <laughs> Okay, so it's nice. I see you getting over people. I see you getting over things. A lot of you are in this energy where it's like, okay, I'm fine being single. It's better to be single than be with the wrong person. And I'm getting here that you're opening yourself up for new possibilities, for new beginnings. Um, and we see a treasure chest here. So it's like Pisces. I'm really getting here that there's something here about you investing into something or you moving towards a particular energy and it turns out really, really good for you. So I'm getting here that in the month of December right now and you know from now up until end of December, I feel like there are a lot of new things that you are going to be welcoming in your life. Um, I also see you getting comfortable in your own skin. There's something here about money, goals achievements okay there could also be a successful partnership or something here about money because i'm getting like the prosperity begins as the ace of pentacles card and ace of pentacles is a new beginning a new start where there's still a lot of potential but in this card in this particular deck we see that the tree is already like it has grown there's the seed so you've already planted the seeds of your manifestation pisces and now it's time for the fulfillment of it because right next to this card we have fulfillment of wishes and by the way towards the end of the reading i'm going to be giving you guided messages so stick around until the end for that um and leave a like on the video okay i'll wait okay <laughs> and subscribe if you haven't already like 50 percent of the people who watch me have not subscribed that's not good anyway so uh, spiritual strength and fulfillment of wishes i said it before as well pisces i see that you're being alone you're fine being single okay you're working towards your goals your money and with the judgment and the throat chakra card here um i'm getting here that there's something here that you're speaking up about and you're going through an awakening for the longest time there was something here that was disrupting your peace of mind it was an idea or just something that was getting repeated in your head over and over again and with the throat chakra energy you're finally speaking up about it so i feel like in the month of december if somebody comes at you and they have some bullshit you're not going to be taking it mm -mm. because you see right through them and with the judgment card, you're already weighing the pros and cons of something before you move into a situation. Some of you have been wanting to travel or maybe go on a vacation, okay? So I'm also getting here that you may be getting vivid dreams or you may be imagining things and they come into reality. So this is a great time for you, Pisces, to work on your self-esteem and to work on yourself. And in the month of December, I just overall see that you are focused on yourself okay which is great because it's not like you're depending on anybody right so you're very much focused on yourself um and welcoming new blessings which is great so let's see what might be your challenge in the month of december what's their challenge movement choices and decisions and the advice is choose wisely temptation reverse so we do have uh, i believe it's towards the end of december i don't know when is it but we are in retrograde period for a lot of planets and things may get a little bit disrupted i do feel like pisces there is somebody here in the past you are leaving behind you're like you know what i'm not gonna let this person or this situation 
uh, mess up with my peace of mind anymore and that person could come back around to have another chance with you to have a new beginning with you and you know the choice here is yours whether you want to go back or not okay with the movement choices decisions and choose wisely energy I'm, I'm getting here the spirit is telling you that you have many different possibilities to redirect your life to redirect your focus and it's all about what you're choosing for yourself because what choices have you made in the past that you regret and what can you change moving forward okay about those choices so choose very wisely where you're investing your time, money, energy, resources. I'm also getting here, again, there's something here about traveling. Now, one more thing I'm getting with your reading is that there's something about choosing wisely when it comes to your emotions, where you're investing your emotions. We have movement choices, decisions. So again, there's something here about the whole month representing that you're going to be constantly making choices to better things in your life, to improve things in your life, to make things better in your life, sorry, and to improve on your life okay so for some of you you may be considering a new career a new path you may be talking to a new person you're trying to close that cycle from the past so you're opening up to new possibilities as you move forward but what's challenging is that you may be feeling a little bit confused making these choices because your choices can be a reflection of your past okay so be careful with that because with the temptation reverse energy spirit is saying what is something you have already like you have overcome this you don't need to go through this again and again and again okay so let's have a look what do we have for pisces shuffle for a so right now you're going through healing for sure um you're taking a break is yes, so is that clarity of mind nice i like it because pisces you're kind of moving from this energy to okay i'm gonna do what feels right for me okay Eight of Swords reverse. There's a lot of that sword energy, Pisces. Bottom of the deck, Eight of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups. Okay, I'm going to talk about this in a bit because it seems like a person coming towards you. You're definitely closing cycles here. Uh, somebody here feels like they don't have any control over you or the situation and you're not even letting them. Um, now, one thing I'm going to tell you, Pisces, is that there is um, an energy here of you moving forward from something that you hoped for, that you wanted. Ace of Swords here brings this energy of newness, okay? New beginnings, new start, new ideas. And I feel like a lot of things for you are also going to become very clear, okay? You may also get a very uh, clear news, in the month of December that's going to make things better for you with the eight of swords reverse energy I like it because you're finally standing up for yourself you're not letting yourself get wrapped around that confusing energy anymore you're, you're gonna see things with more clarity and I feel like that energy shift already happened for you after eclipse season but that lasts for the next six months at least so what I'm getting for you Pisces is that you're really you're really overcoming some form of an obstacle. You're really overcoming some form of a challenging situation here, okay? Um, now, with the Strength in the World card, you're closing cycles. You're moving towards a more, um, like, it's a very victorious energy where there are new possibilities for you. But with the Strength card, you still need to hold on to your inner strength and courage while making these choices. Because there may be people who come into your life and they're like, oh, no, you should be doing this, you should be doing that. So this is all about your inner power, okay? Now, your overall energy for the month is the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, I, I really like it because Pisces, you're going to feel very stable throughout the month, especially when it comes to money. We, we do have Jupiter in our sign, Pisces. I'm a Pisces myself. So with the Eight of Wands, the, the month is also very focused on communication, forward swift movement. So if you feel like there were things in your life that were stuck, 
they're definitely going to get moving again. Things are going to be more balanced moving forward. And with the Queen of Pentacles, this is you standing in your power. This is like, okay, I recognize my worth, my value, what I've strived for. And I'm ready to move forward. So in the month of December, there's going to be a lot of swift movement forward. A lot of things are going to pick up pace in your life, especially if there were energies that were seeming stuck. And I see you enjoying yourself having a good time being single educating yourself on new things and i see you very focused on your goals as well now the problem here is that there's a person here who's losing hope with you and they're feeling very overwhelmed when it comes to their emotions pisces this person oh see with the nine of wands reverse and the knight of cups reverse this person is wanting to open up to you but they're feeling very overwhelmed, first of all. And secondly, I feel like there's a person here who tried to forget about you by talking to other people and they've failed at it. Because with the Ten of Pentacles, the Empress, you are the one for them. They see you as the one, okay? However, moving forward when it comes to your love life, look at all these energies. You're kind of blocking these energies of the past, Pisces, because you feel like you 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 made a wrong choice in love okay and you feel like you weren't respected in that situation with the empress the ten of pentacles the ace of cups and the ace of wands so i'm really getting here that you have a new beginning here okay with the ace of cups and the ace of wands we also have two aces here which is the ace so you have all aces actually look at this ace of pentacles ace of swords ace of cups ace of wands so you have all aces I feel like 2023 is going to be a very fresh start for you, Pisces. Okay, you do have a new person coming your way. You do have a new love interest. You have something good going on with your money. But when it comes to your past person, they're very overwhelmed. And I feel like they're going to make an appearance. <laughs> But that's why you have this uh, card here of choose wisely. I feel like someone from the past is definitely going to come into your life this month. And again, it is up to you what, what you're really choosing, Pisces, who you really want to be with. Do you really want to be with them or you're fine without them? That is for you to decide, honey. I want you to think of a question and we will see what shows up for you after this. I'm going to pull answers for you. Or if you don't have a question, that will be your guided message. I will be linking the extended in the description box. Pisces, if you're interested, you can have a look at it. Okay, for bonus messages in regards to your person who's coming towards you. And what do you need to know in general and your career as well? So do have a look. It will be linked below for you okay what do we have for pisces sun moon rising and venus signs we have past life relationship it does look like there is a deep sense of familiarity with somebody pisces but that relationship was very deceptive it's like you always like this person was playing that cat and mouse game with you you were like chasing after them or then they would chase after you so there was always some deception involved and lack of clear communication and lack of clear even just understanding of one another right love yourself first so spirit is telling you to take a break if it is required okay some of you need to disconnect from everything around you and give yourself that time and space that you want and put yourself first in the month of december focus on yourself more now let's see what is your guided message pisces to close off this reading let's see what is the guided message for Pisces to close off this reading, please? What is the guided message for Pisces? Ooh perfect timing 
All right, so things in your life are going to turn out perfectly well for you according to the time that they're supposed to happen. So you don't need to rush, you don't need to put extra effort into things. I also feel like, like I said, Pisces, you're going to feel a lot more confident and you're going to feel like you're at ease, you know, in the month of December. So I want you to give this video a like and claim this message. We also have opportunity and within the next few weeks. So there is an opportunity to grow, to expand coming towards you within the next few weeks Pisces so just prepare yourself for these changes they're gonna happen sooner than you think that's it Pisces thank you so much for being here those were the messages that showed up for you the extended about your person is going to be linked in the description box below if you're interested I will also be linking your soulmate reading in the description box below take care and bye, -bye.